Hey buddy, Dom here, and welcome back to another episode of Dom Plays Portal Custom Map Something Nailway. Something because I can't pronounce it. Something Nailway. Perhaps I just I just I should just say just say Nailway because Nailway sounds like something pronounceable. Let's go forth. Here we are. Where we last left off, we went through here. Can you even go back? I feel the answer is no. Yeah, it's just it's just a wall. Very dark to see. Perhaps you can't even see it. Let's go forth. There's only one way to go, and it's up. Now, how does this work? Even though I know the, I know the answer to that, but perhaps you don't. Let's go on. It sort of like pushes you in a really glitchy way. So you think like, oh, you gotta use portals to climb up this area. Nope. You use these jump pad sort of things. Hmm. Arrows. I wonder what that means. Hello, jump pads. There we go. I, I, yeah, this is what you do. And I failed. GG. How do I get back now? Um. Ooh, can I just jump this? Huh. Uh, huh, that works. Strafe jumping. How does it work? No one knows. Except for people that aren't into math and stuff. Yeah, you're able to strafe jump a little bit in Portal. Whoa! I didn't intend to jump up right away. Whoa, okay, there we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa okay, okay. Good, good, good. Made it. Excellent, excellent. Let's go up here. Up here. So, this game, this game, it, it goes to show that some Portal 2 elements, like jump pad things, because jump pad things are in Portal 2, are possible in Portal 1. This room is really nice. Kind of trippy in a weird way. I like it. Let's go forth. Yeah, I guess it's another teleporter. Alright, this room is, a, is the epitome of weirdness. You'll find out why. Perhaps. You got this one tile, it's really weird. It's broken. I can't shoot anything on it. Cool animation, though. It even has a little, little hand thing from Portal 2. Eh, like, mechanical hands. Meanwhile, music plays in the background. This... It turns off that portal, I think. Oh, yeah, no, it, it extends and de-extends that. All right, what's this do? Opens that, that thing up. Okay, what does this do? Staircase. I can see that being helpful. Hmm. A weird Kleiner face zoomed in. I wonder if this will come into play later on. Spoiler. Uh, hint, hint. I, I guess. I don't know. Kleiner face. Forget, forget that exists for now. What's down here? Let's go! A button. Open up another thing. Another thing. With a ticking sound effect. Wait, I can't escape now. Oh, whoops. Hmm. Now, what you see, what you gotta do here is... Go quickly. First enter the first area. Enter in, and... Go quick. Escape. Go over here. Click in the second area. Go back. Go in here. Click the button. Escape. Escape again. Go here, put the portal on the last surface, and enter in, and you get the cube! Companion cube. Let's go Let's go forth, companion cube with black outline. Uh, let's tackle this puzzle next. This one. Alright. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming, and I actually know the answer, this will shoot out a ball of energy. And there's uh, another energy ball thing. Huh. Wait a minute. No, 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 no. There's a missing link here, and the, why is that arrow backwards? And the missing link is <laughs> off topic. The missing link is it doesn't work like this. You gotta first put the portal here or something. So click button, get the ball of energy through the thing. As soon as it goes through, a heart seek is kind of light. You put the portal here, so when it bounces back off the wall, it'll go back through, and it just did it regardless of what I said. Yeah, it, it bounced right there. See, and it came back. All right, so two portals, two things done. Check mark. Opening up this area for this for this cube. All right. So we're gonna put this over here. Uh, are they? Oh, come on. Over. Come on. Here. Run. Oh, it didn't work. Come on. Oh, okay, I got it. I don't think that requires running. You could probably jump in there some some other way. Okay, this one here. Extending that out. So I'm gonna just fling myself like usual. And I'm now in this area here, and I click the button and get under the portal. For some reason, the check marks are backwards. I guess it's just a, a, a just a, a, a theme in this map. Go here. That triggered all three, and now I can enter this area here. Interesting. A new test chamber appears before me. Alright. And a giant monitor on the wall. Okay. Can I escape? No. Can I, how do I get out of here, then, I guess? Oh, yeah, portal. It's always portals. <gasps> What's happening? 
As if I didn't know. Oh! Being attached to the wall! Whoa! Alright! So now I have five minutes to get a bunch of cubes. I see one there. And, oh, here we, here we go. Easy as pie. Ugh. Okay, you go down there for a second. Um, Down this area here. There should be a cube. Ooh, coffee machine. Is there time for coffee? It actually does something when you click it. What the hell? <laughs> awesome. Oh, uh, I guess down here. Oh, there we go. Go, cube. And now I, I make my escape. And now we have two cubes. Sweet. Um, how do you get up there? Oh, I see. This area here. Go. And then go back through here. And there's a button. Oh no! This is a little different than I expected. I guess I have to put a cube there. Hmm. Let's put a cube there. What does this do? Hmm. It does check mark. It's just the, the, the location the cube is supposed to go in. Okay, can I, can, I, can, I, can I put a cube here and just jump on here? And I, I guess you do that last. What do I do with this one? Oh crap, I think I need both cubes. Quickly, give me back that cube. Like, this is this is not me joking around. I, I, I There is a, a time limit and I must obey the time limit. Go here. And... Oh, don't follow me! I think this is one of the situations where the cubes look look normal. They don't have the black outline sort of coolness. Uh, come on. There, there we go. Cube. Perfect. You go here. Okay. Can I just do it an easier way? Can I just fall on it? Uh, there we go. And good. Now put one cube here. And the final cube goes upstairs for some reason. Um, blah. I guess I'll follow it here. So I can put it on the button. Makes perfect sense. Let's go. Success! Let's leave this room and never remember it again. Bye, room. Bye-bye. Okay. And now, I've been granted the ability to put both down the two portals. Different portals. Different portals. This one and this one. Infinite loop. Okay, enough of that. That was fun for like a moment. <laughs> that was weird. Let's go forth. Uh, new map loads? Maybe. Maybe a new lap map is loading. I can't tell. It's, it's pitch black. It's pitch black. You can't tell. Oh, uh, no graphs. Wait, what did that say? What did that say? I didn't read that in time. Huh? This elevator's sideways. This doesn't seem good. Solution: Square T R. LL7 door. Okay. Let's go here. Do, 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 Oh no! Oh, whoa, it broke! Whoa! Hey, that's pretty cool though, for real though. That's. Let's watch this! Science. I want to get a better view. Not really. Hello, friend, and I don't want to put the, the, the curse, cursor on screen. It probably doesn't matter. Located in sunny. Classified location name here. Before we begin exploring the benefits of being an Aperture employee, let's meet our good friend Charlie. Say hello now, Charlie. Good job, Charlie. As you can see, Charlie is having a lot of fun trying to solve various puzzles located throughout the Enrichment Center. We'll be checking in with Charlie later. But first... A brief history of Aperture Science! At 
Aperture Science's brilliant founder, Cave Johnson, in his valiant efforts to save humanity, founded a shower curtain manufacturing plant for use by the U.S. military in 1953. Business was good, but then the 1970s came about, and with them, new ideas, bold ideas, built upon the foundation of psychotropic and hallucinogenic drugs, or in this case, mercury poisoning. Inspired by his newfound mercury-given insight, Cave Johnson began a bold three-tier research and development plan. First, he invented the Heimlich Countermaneuver. Then he founded the highly successful Take-A-Wish Foundation. And last, but certainly not least, he set out to create a man-sized ad hoc quantum tunnel through physical space with various possible applications as a shower curtain. And thus, the Aperture Science Enrichment Center was born! Speaking of man-sized ad hoc quantum tunnels through physical space, let's check in on our good friend Charlie. Hey, Charlie! How's it going? Charlie sure seems confused. Ha ha ha! Oh, Charlie, there's no need to lose your marbles over a simple puzzle. All you have to do is remember these three simple steps. Step 1. Observe the situation. Step 2. Contemplate all possible outcomes. Step 3. Make the decision that you think is for the best. Now that you know the three steps to good puzzle solving, let's see if Charlie was able to apply these steps professionally. Oh, Charlie? Charlie? Silly Charlie! He did. So, once again, in review, observe the situation, contemplate all possible outcomes, and make the decision that you think is for the best. Don't be a Charlie. Successfully complete all of the challenges before you, and you too shall be rewarded with cake. Just as... Yes, baby. Test subjects have before you. This has been an Aperture Science and After Eye Free Counseling Video. We here at Aperture Science hope you have a great day. And that was a video. Okay. <laughs> Let's uh proceed with this puzzle. Hey, here's the key. A B C D E F. Huh. Uh, I guess I use that with the other numbers. Or, I can just wing it. <laughs> I forgot how this works. Let's click this button. Wrong. This button. Wrong. This button. Correct. This button. Wrong. Correct. Two, one. Two, four? Five. No. Two, four, one. Two, four, one, three. Two, four, one, three. Five, six. All right, this seems this seems reasonable. Well, that was easy. Turns out winging it works. And then there are explosions. And then I can see the outdoors. Weird. Click more buttons. Hmm. Well, that was fun. Uh oh, you can see this area too. Here too. Cool. And the area down here as well. Hmm. Okay. But the image changed? Oh, it changed to this. Now I guess it's just a static image now. Interesting. Uh this is glass so you can't put foil through it. Okay. Okay, this is like something on a previous playthrough. Like let uh I remember distinctly that this portal is supposed to it's supposed to close and this sort of messed up the the, the programming later on eh, you'll see what I mean perhaps maybe and I'm gonna have to like do redo this, this section of the map again we'll see perhaps not but uh, I'm stuck uh, okay here's one another example invisible wall I'm stuck in an invisible wall you're supposed to fall down here Ugh. S3 cheats. No clip. Go here. No clip again. All right, all. So. Yay! That was fun. We're in an area, in a place, in a thing, and a ball comes out. 
and the ball. Yeah, I think it's gonna be this is gonna be broken. Because this portal is supposed to close. So that the ball comes out and hits that thing over there. And so this area is not possible because I can't close this portal. This portal's in nothingness air. So it's just like a weird common bug that exists in this map. You're not supposed to be able to go see this, this portal's not supposed to exist. You're not supposed to be able to go through it, like I just did. This, this area here is like all outside the map, you could clearly see it. You're not supposed to be here. Like this 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 torch texture only has a texture on one side, for example. You can see the outdoors a little better if you want. There are two suns? What the hell? What? What? I wonder if that's intentional. Huh. Okay. So I guess I'll cut the footage and try again. Oh, meanwhile, the, 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 this kick and music starting. Do 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 do. Okay, so I'm gonna cut back in. But then again, this episode's 15 minutes in or 16 minutes in or something. Perhaps I just I should just end it off. Yeah, that seems like a more a more reasonable idea. You know, when you get stuck at like a glitch that occurs over and over sometimes, it's unfortunate. That tries again. Yeah. So until next time, whatever. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Oh, whatever. Uh, it's music though. It's music though. This music though.